Providence is suing a major bank, accusing it of discriminating against minority neighborhoods and hurting the city's economic recovery. Eyewitness News reporter Jared Pliner has the new details from the mobile newsroom. In the lawsuit, the city of Providence accuses Santander Bank of engaging in a practice called redlining. Mayor Angel Tavares announced the details of the lawsuit this morning. The city claims that since 2009, Santander has deliberately denied prime loans to people living in minority neighborhoods, even to people who qualify for them. Mayor Tavares says the limited lending has depressed home prices in those neighborhoods and made it harder to rehabilitate blighted properties. By denying our minority communities good loans, Santander is making it harder for these neighborhoods to recover from the devastating effects of the foreclosure crisis that was caused by irresponsible subprime lending. This is a new manifestation of an old civil rights issue that has now reared its ugly head once again. The city also claims Santander increased lending in predominantly white neighborhoods over the same time period and that redlining is also going on in Boston and in other New England cities. And Eyewitness News has received a statement from Santander Bank. In it, the bank, quote, categorically rejects the city's accusation. And he's Providence with the Providence Mobile Newsroom. I'm Jared Pleiter, Eyewitness News.